reflux is a common condition in many patients which is usually controlled with medications. But when symptoms are severe such as coughing, choking, refluxing even when sitting up and these are not being controlled with medication and lifestyle modification, surgery should be considered. A normal esophagus should reach about 2 to 4 cm into the abdomen so that positive pressures in the abdomen prevent reflux by closing the esophagus. When the esophagus does not reach well into the abdomen, positive pressure in the abdomen tends to push stomach contents into the chest, causing reflux. A hiatal hernia is a situation where the top of the stomach and occasionally other organs are passing up into the chest through a lax diaphragmatic opening. This also contributes to reflux. Laparoscopic Nissen fundoplication is the surgery for reflux and hiatal hernias. This involves returning any herniating stomach or organs back into the abdomen. The esophagus is also dissected to bring 2 to 4 centimeters of lower esophagus into the abdomen. Attachments between the upper stomach and the spleen are divided. The lax opening of the diaphragm around the esophagus is closed. An anti-reflux valve is created by wrapping the upper part of the stomach around the lower end of the esophagus. This operation usually requires only an overnight hospital stay. It has been shown to be a durable long-term treatment for reflux disease and hiatal hernias.